Welcome to lesson 225. God is my father and his son loves him. Welcome to the Qigong support for A Course in Miracles students. I'm Judith and this is part of the Lucid Mind Center, which is a virtual center to retraining the mind. The reason why this is a Qigong support is because after reading this lesson together with you, I'm going to guide you to a selection of Qigong classes, two of which are specially recorded for this part of the Course in Miracles, which we have got the leading idea, what is forgiveness. And in the class, you're also going to have a moment where you can read the idea of your lesson and also the prayer to our source, to our God, and then we are going to sink into meditation and listen for the answer, if you will. So let's begin. God is my father and his son loves him. It means we love our father. And then this time it starts with the prayer. Father, I must return your love for me. Forgiving and receiving are the same and you have given all your love to me. I must return it, for I wanted mine in full awareness, blazing in my mind and keeping it within its kindly light, inviolate, beloved, with fear behind and only peace ahead. How still the way your loving son is led along to you. Beautiful, it's like a circle. So we are receiving love from God, which is all around us, and we are sending love out. And the way we are sending love out is by recognizing that any kind of feeling of love is the expression of God. Any kind of kindness or compassion you have within yourself, it is an expression of God. And then it says, brother, we find that stillness now. And this is so important in A Course in Miracles. And I can tell you, I did not understand that the first time round when I did it in 2008, I began. I did not understand the, the importance of the stillness, the importance of the introspection, of actually going into meditation and finding the right meditation which is working for you. This is also why I've recorded Qigong, because... Mm, a lot of people say just sit in meditation and wait for the answer but many people first have to learn how to train the mind to still the mind and understand that they are not their mind brother we find that stillness now and that is why I'm inviting you in to come with me to this Qigong class if you do it in the morning I definitely recommend you doing the standing class the way is open now we follow in the peace together. You have reached your hand to me and I will never leave you. We are one. It is but this oneness that we seek as we accomplish these few final steps which end a journey that was not begun. So we're basically returning back to stillness. We are returning back within and those two qigong classes i have recorded one is a standing one it takes longer it's about 30 minutes and the other one it's about 15 minutes it's a seated one but if you're doing this in the morning i definitely recommend you do the standing one as we are going to purify the whole body from top to bottom we're going to get rid of the stress level we, we accumulate uh, around our waist and in the kidneys and this is also where the fear is according to qigong and afterwards we're going to sink into a deep nice meditation and it's going to be very profound the seated one we're not doing so much preparation but we're also going to tap through the whole body but is more suited for doing it in the evening and you just Put your book next to, me, next to you and I'm going to guide you through from the beginning to the end and we're going to really capture what forgiveness is as well. Also, it is suggested that you read the forgiveness 
idea at least once a day. So I'm going to link you to the forgiveness as well. So here you have got the standing meditation, here you've got the seated meditation, and here you have got the forgiveness reading, which I suggest you do with me. Let me know how it goes. Love, light and chi to you.